Alright guys, it's been a while, but I'm back, and hopefully we'll be able to stay for quite a lot longer than what I did last time whenever I originally started streaming. Um, I'm going to have to get used to it again, even though I wasn't super used to it to begin with. Um, I tried recording the videos at the time while streaming, but didn't work out, so hopefully I'm able to figure that out now and we will be able to have everything go good and hopefully I pop off and everyone enjoys I'm gonna just make sure real quick that I am recording cute. I am sorry about that. I am Be here. Be here. They're just trying to figure Be all here. this out. They're just trying to figure all this out. They're just trying to figure all this out. They're just trying to figure all this out. Dashboard, that's what it is. I do apologize everyone that this is taking forever. All right, hopefully everything is going good now. I think I got everything set up the way I want it. And I should be able to do everything right from now on. All right, uh, it's been a while, but this is the super flat survival that we started a while back that I realize looks different. Um, I haven't played too much since then. Um, just a little bit. Right now, I'm just gonna mine some cobblestone real quick. Make sure we got plenty of that. Huh. 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 
try to see how many people are viewing. Oh, it looks like just one. Oh, I actually got a decent amount in here. Attack you really quick. Uh, gonna throw it down, throw a couple of these in here. I'll have to start a potato farm. And another potato farm. It's great. Thought that was wrong. I think the biggest thing that we're gonna do next is make a mob spawner. Just so that I have unlimited bone meal. I think that will be the biggest play here. sure that's what I got all this cobblestone for in the first place was that. I think extra bucket always helps. Sorry guys, it's just been a while. I'm still trying to get used to talking to myself again. Gonna be moving out of my house within the about a little over a month or so. So that'll be cool. Lease is up, so I'm gonna be moving into an apartment. Hopefully, get back into the military. I'm trying to re-enlist into the National Guard. That'd be cool. not near enough cobblestone for what we need, but it will have to do. I don't want to just bore everyone with um, mining cobblestone, because obviously this is so entertaining for everyone. Also, if anyone has any ideas on what other games you might want me to play, that would be greatly appreciated. I always love taking in intel on what people want to watch. And why are you out? Have them make more villagers. Hopefully, get a decent group of them going so I can start trading, get some good, good armor, stuff like that. I'd love to see a comment from those of you who are watching. Uh, make my life a little bit easier so I can. See what y'all have to say. Know how long you've been in the chat, but um, re-enlisting, so that's gonna be pretty cool. Hopefully that works out. If 
not. I don't really know what I'm gonna do, but I have to figure it out from there. Maybe this pops off. I do this for a living. That'd be pretty cool. I do love playing video games. I like talking to people. Love making people's day better, helping out people in any way I can. Yeah, mentally, physically, serving country, community, or just bringing joy from entertainment like this. I think that's the biggest thing that why I do what I do is I want to help people. And I've had my issues in the past, but you know I just want to want to help people, make them happy. I think that would be good. Hopefully get a good long stream in this today though. I definitely want to pop this off again where I'm planning on streaming every day. At least for 30 minutes to an hour every day. Now today it's going to be a long one. I'm not, I don't work today so. Definitely think I want to do a nice long stream today. Um, jump into it hard. That's probably the best thing to do. Just send it. I also think I'm going to talk to a couple of my buddies of mine who are uh, music artists. Um, see if I can use their music that they make and use that for videos that I edit and stuff like that of these streams. Hopefully pick up some sponsors too. Um, maybe not huge ones, obviously probably not huge ones at first, but um, I can definitely see Hopefully down the line also um, do some vlogs, um, do some fishing videos, hunting videos, that'd be really cool. Maybe some range days, that'd be really cool too. After this pickaxe gets destroyed, I have enough cobblestone. I'll be able to make this mob farm real quick. Get a good little thing going with that. I think the biggest reason I want to do this uh, super flat survival though is because I watch a YouTuber uh, named Mog Swap. And he got me really into the idea of the super flat survival. Um, Luke the Notable coined the 100 days though. I'm going to be honest with you. He got me motivated to do like 100 days. But I don't think I'm going to be doing no. Obviously, hopefully it goes longer than that. Um, sorry, I just blanked for a second. But um, hopefully it goes longer than that, obviously. As long as people enjoy what I'm doing, I'm going to keep doing it. It's the biggest thing, as long as people enjoy it.
I'm also going to need to make a tree farm because this is very much not going to be good if I don't have any torches on top of this thing. I made a lot of planks, or slabs, but did not do anything else I need to do. Might have to add a couple mods down the line just to make life a little easier in it. Also gonna have to add some hoppers in here. Just so it makes life a little easier for me. Collecting everything, that'd probably be the best thing to do. Is some double chest, four hoppers. Sorry that I keep going quiet also, it's just still trying to get used to talking to myself pretty much. It's kind of weird. Oh, it's almost bed. It's almost time to go to sleep. I definitely did that. I'm dum dum. See how the villagers are doing. Tighter play, I definitely don't have that. I'm probably not going to be able to get that either. decent amount of this bad boy done. It's the best that we could hope for.
I also think I want to make an iron farm. That'll probably be the, one of the next biggest things to do is make that. At least hopefully. Yeah, I'm not going to have near enough what I need. Probably going to need a, another 10 or so stacks. Which isn't too big of a deal. I just don't want to want to deal with it to be honest Actually, what I want to do is that. So we got the base of it done, which is good. Now all we need to do is the platforms. Get them bad boys done. Rocking and rolling. Get the platforms done, put walls, put a roof on it. We got horses and pigs there. We got cattle over there. So that's really good. Probably gonna make a bigger cattle pin. Move the pig pin over here somewhere. a little closer in night time than, that, than what it is. Oh, and there's a village over there, so that's good. I do not remember digging out there. 
So that must be a mine shaft. Which some of you might think, oh, why, why is there a mine shaft in a super flat world? And what you can do actually is if you load the game in an older version of it, and then you update, do the updates to it, you can have everything from past versions of super flat. Which in this case would mean you can have structures like that. Which I would love to find the end portal so we can go to the end at some point in the near future. Hopefully also I'm fairly certain that I'm going to be close to finishing all four of these. At least finishing three. So I will not need as much cobblestone as I thought, which is a really good thing actually. stack maybe a little bit more left for this one plus a few stacks for the walls and probably five for the roof so yeah probably about eight stacks left which is okay it's not a big deal um, I'll let the crops grow just a little bit more. While well, mining, um, try and come up with some conversation, hopefully. Hopefully we get a mini villager also pretty soon. That'd be really cool. Um, get an armor, get a weapon smith, get a tool smith, that'd be great. Cause what I'm wearing now in the game ain't really a chief. I would also love to go to the nether pretty soon because, well obviously it's the nether, that'd be pretty great. Now what I think my issue is going to be, since I surrounded my property with water, 
is luckily not slimes anymore, but other mobs are gonna spawn like drown and stuff like that. Which could turn out to be an issue, but hopefully not. Which now that it's raining, I'm probably gonna go to sleep just cause I don't think that I really want to deal with that. Uh, yes sir, it is a cobble farm. Because I am on a super flat world. I think I decided to just go with the super flat survival. Which, if that's the case, do you want to, uh... Hop in Discord, good sir, and I can hop on there with you. Sorry about that, guys. I'm calling my buddy up so we can shoot the shit. How's it going, man? Uh, it's going pretty good. How are you, boss man? Ah, so far, so good. Today is finally my day off. Uh, that's kind of... I had a three-day weekend this weekend, and I'm not happy about it. Oh, damn. Yeah, I prefer working. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. I just, I just decided to up and start streaming again. I see that. Yeah. What have you been up to, though? Uh, re trying to re-enlist. Gotcha. And, uh... Let's see. How's it going with that package? So I sent it to you, and they sent it back to my house, so I'm going to another um, post office because for some reason right. they sent it back to my house that it was because it was an electronic USPS, they didn't want to do it for some reason. Gotcha. Um, so I'm going to use hey, I'm gonna... hmm. That's kind of irritating. Yeah, I know, because I spent money on it too. Hmm. But, um, how about you? What have you been into? Um, let's see. I ended up quit working at McDonald's. Uh, I'm working here in Dairy Mart again. And I've been working here since February 24th. But, um, as of late, when I'm not working, I've been... Taking care of my dog, Zeus, and playing a mix between RL Craft and Final Fantasy. Uh, which Final Fantasy have you been playing? Uh, I've been going back and forth between uh, 10, 3, and 12. Sounds pretty dope. Yeah, and on my phone I've been playing Tactics. Nice. I don't know, I've been uh, mainly playing um, the Avengers game that came out a couple years ago on my Xbox. Dang. Which I'm about 83% of the way done with that campaign. <laughs> nice. I'm about to hop on the DLCs for it. Gotcha. Yeah, I, I also ended up beating a, uh, a Souls-like game called uh, Hollow Knight. Oh yeah, I've heard of that. Yeah, I ended up beating it with uh, over 83 hours in the game. Nice. 
<laughs> and so, uh, I, and, like, I didn't fully complete it, but I got to the end point and defeated the end boss. But, um, I was going to get one of the secret endings. Kind of kill the boss, so I was like, eh, I already got this far, and I pretty much was guaranteed that ending if I could figure out how the hell to kill the fucking radiance. But, um, I decided to restart that file and play a, a modded version of it where it gave upgrades to, to all the skills to see how quickly I could do it. Oh, okay. And uh, I'm about just over halfway through the game with not even 10 hours. Obviously, because I'm not caring about completion or anything this time around. Oh, I got you. I forgot to put a, a water bucket down. <laughs> Very skilled. Yeah, but... yeah. Very skilled right there. Don't tell me you died. No, I didn't die. Alright. It OCC's been pissing me off lately. Uh what has? Uh my bank. Because, um, I, I told you about that guy that had access to my accounts, right? Um, no. In Florida? Alright, so yeah, um, apparently someone had access to my account, um, in Tampa, Florida. At least that's the address they were using. And, um, so I, it took about three, four months to get that whole thing resolved. Mm -hmm. Through that case, um... My bank completely dropped one of their partners be um, because they um, ended up botching the case and probably several others. And um, they sent out false, false mail saying that my case was closed and all the credits that I was allotted due to the problem were going to be taken out of my account. What actually happened was the case was closed, but I'd be getting all those credits permanently. And so, I thought that was the end of my problems. Just the, literally two days ago, at the end of my shift of work, I was trying to buy some milk and what all I ate and drank at work, right? Yeah. It ended up saying invalid pin when I was using the only pin that I've ever set for this card. Mm -hmm. And uh, I tried one of my other pins for a completely different card. Still said invalid. And so I eventually got it to try and run it as credit. And um, for some weird reason, it still said invalid pin. When you don't need a pin if you're running credit. So, uh, yeah. I'm going to be going to the bank now with my dad. Yeah, that's probably something that you want to resolve. Yeah, especially seeing as how I also need to save up my money so that way I can afford rent here. Mm -hmm. Um, let's see what else. Uh, also need to save up money to, um, get my dog fixed and just seen in general. This, and then, gotta try and contact the VA again, because, like, honestly, though, my injury hasn't been impeding me much. The only downside to it 
is that it affected like my grip and everything. Like periodically, shit just falls out of my hands. Yeah. Or um, let's see, what else is happening? Like, like um, also I can't stand and stand being in a cold environment for too long anymore either. Like I can't even take cold showers like I used to in boot camp. And let me tell you, those things, those cold showers in boot camp were some of the best fucking showers. Yeah, you're fucking crazy if you think that, but okay. Oh, no, because uh, I would always take a scouting hot shower first. But, and then I would slowly ease the water into being colder. Like, it was, it felt great. Honestly, though, I missed the days of boot camp. Those were good days. Yeah, Even if I was in the recovery team for most of it. <laughs> yeah, because life was easy as fuck. Oh, that, and I actually had friends. <laughs> I actually had people to hang out with. <laughs> oh, shit, I don't know. I just enjoyed not having fucking bills. Right? Also, then you don't have to worry about being single, because most of the fucking people there are, so they can't really make fun of you. But yeah, no. And then Jody got to the rest of them. Yup. Alright. Yeah, it's... <laughs> Rip Walker. Huh. Not our boy that went to Bravo, but the one that was stuck in the wheelchair. Uh-huh. And though, Rip the other... Rip Bravo Walker as well. The one that actually made it to the fleet. He, uh... He apparently has been diagnosed with being allergic to the fucking sun. So yeah, he's not doing too hot. The one who, uh, Willie Walker Jr.? No, the other one. Uh, he was there before Wheeler. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Like, uh, at first they thought he had skin cancer, but no, he's allergic to the sun's rays. Oh, good. This isn't good. Not good. Fuck. What is going on, dude? Um, I oh. have a mob spawning. Gotcha. I thought you had uh, the stream up. Oh, uh, I did, but not now is going through the stream and Discord. Oh yeah. So yeah, I, I just paused the stream so that way it doesn't echo from my phone uh, stream into. I got you. I figured you would just muted it. And I don't have a pickaxe. Oh, fuck. Me, RL craft. Oh yeah, that's probably a good reason not to mute it. But yeah, no, uh, let's see. Shit. Do you think you might be able to make it out here to Oregon for, uh, August 16th? Uh, that is an absolute no. Damn it. Okay. 
I'm trying to get at least one of the boys out for my birthday. I yeah, I'm not even close to being able to do that. You gotcha. Like I'm moving I'm moving in like a month, so. Oh shit, where to? Uh, it's still in Texas. It's just my lease is up, so I gotta get an apartment. Ah, uh, alright. Can't renew it? No, my landlord is selling the house. Oh, uh, shit. Dude, that's been happening to a lot of people. What the fuck? Well, our landlord sucks, too, so it's fine. Nah, uh, because that also happened to Caitlin, my ex. Her dad's landlord straight up up and sold their house. And all the fucking property that they pretty much bought from the owner. Mm -hmm. And, uh... They just got it all yanked out from underneath them. Which, honestly, I find kind of funny. Because ever since the two of us broke up, everything that could be going wrong is basically going wrong towards her. Which I find funny because normally it happens the other way around. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I uh, I should have mined another stack of cobblestone. Probably. Maybe started up a bigger tree farm. Yeah, I don't. I just started that one because I didn't have any trees. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, I also went and saw the new D&D &D movie when it came out. Was it good? Oh dude, it was fucking hilarious. I should probably go and watch it. What's up? I should probably go and watch it. Yeah. Just for warning, you'll see my dog but in dragon form. Oh, not mine, but my brother's. <laughs> it's funny as hell. It is the most pathetic thing you will ever see. That fucking dragon. Oh, did you hear what happened to Louie, though? No, nah, what happened? <laughs> so, you remember his, uh, his, uh, I think it was fiance, right? Yeah. The one from Germany? Yeah. Uh, she basically tried to, uh, ditch him and steal all of his shit while he was in. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. Thing is, her family still loves him. <laughs> it's funny as hell. At least that's what he told me back in. Fuck, I think it was September or something. I can't remember. Yeah, no. Nah. Told me that a while ago. Oh, I gotta say, September? What the fuck? Yeah. You gotta figure, I've been back for almost a year, dude. No, it's, it's been almost a year. I'm not worried about that. I'm just saying, I'm like, I'm surprised I didn't know about that, being that it's been so long. Yep. It's sometime between either September and uh, about four months ago. Because I was still working at McDonald's when it happened. Hmm. And I was working at McDonald's uh, after my uh, 
uh, 20th birthday, but bef um, before New Year's, I think it was. So yeah, it was a long ass time ago. Also, I'm trying to look for people to play some D&D &D with me. <laughs> no luck yet. Well, in all fairness, so am I. <laughs> right. Also, another little side project I'm working on is uh, trying to create my own little, effectively homebrewed version of D&D, &D, where it's combining the best halves of... Uh, fifth edition and third, or three point five. Oh, okay. So like it'll have all of the, it'll have the character sheet layout of three point five, but it will include the, uh, like proficiency point system from fifth. Oh, okay. But that uh, sounds pretty cool. That will be introducing, like, there will be more of racial proficiencies rather than points that you can actually put in. Oh, okay. Uh, and due to the fact that it will, in fact, be using factor from 3.5, it will have the negative uh, racial mod modifiers to things. Like, uh, Halflings and gnomes get minus two to strength. That will be, still be a thing. Dep be, uh, depending on which uh, sub race you choose, if you want to pick one. Because that will be an option. Or you could just pick the generic race. And uh, it will be... Uh, using uh, prestige classes as well, as well as um, paragon classes after level 15 will be an option. Hmm. And those are racial classes only. So yeah. Alright man, I gotta go, I'm at my dad's. Alright. Talk to you later, man. Yep, talk to you later, bro. Bye. Bye. Alright, guys. Um, carrying on from that. I think I will jump down here. Oh, wow. Uh -huh. Was almost bad. Ah. Not quite. Mm. All right. Mm. So we gotta finish out this mob farm, and we will be set.
Okie dokie. Got a decent amount of bones. What are you doing here, mate? No, I definitely do think I'm going to need to put some hoppers up in here because that's going to get annoying quick. Shirt, that. Okay, tight. Hopefully, get a nice little farm going up in here. Also, because these achievements are popping up, I'm going to say it. I didn't cheat. I had to make a new account to log in and it had my old world yes but i'm like i'm not cheating that shit pisses me off because obviously why would i cheat just to make a shitty farm I could do something else like might get diamonds or shit like that. Plus, my mob farm is working out way better than I thought it would. Which, it's super flat world and I'm surrounded by water, so I don't know why I'm surprised, but I am. Now the only thing I need to do is get torches and I can put fuck up out of the area around me, so we should just spawn down here. Oh, <laughs> 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 
Now, one cool thing that would be really cool to have is a enchantment table. Now, I don't... Actually, I do think I could get an enchantment table. I just have to get really lucky. I like that. I mean, whenever I go to another, find a bastion and or find diamonds and chests. In the overworld. Now, do I think that's going to really happen? Fudge, no. But I have a bow now. And what I think I want to do... is fudge around and find out with some shit. I like you too. I'd also really like to make an automatic farm for potatoes and carrots. Make like two or three of them. I like the small ones that just hit it all the time because that would make life so much easier. I would love an enchantment table right now. Ha 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 
So hopefully we can get close to finishing out this carrot farm. Finish out this carrot farm. Um, get more potatoes going. Get more emeralds. Get better food. Get better armor, better tools. Okay, enchantment table. So I think that's like one of the biggest flexes you can have here in a super flat world is an enchantment table. Just think about how difficult those are to get. two bows decent attack on it. okay oh uh -huh. we got two sitting in there Now I'm gonna make a run for that. I think that's the best thing to do right now. Well, there's that. Now, I'm going to have to come back out to that because I don't have an iron pick on me. And should I have made one? Probably. I'm going to be real. I probably should have. That's good to know that's there.
mainly because now I don't have to build a whole nether portal. Is it a walk from my house? Absolutely. Do I want to walk it? Not really. Will I? Probably. <laughs> kind of the best thing that I can, best logic I can give you there. There are way you can get gripstone in this. That's why I'm wondering, because if that's the case, I can get unlimited lava. Clutch Arena. Also, not going anywhere near that. Damn, this village had two Fletchers. That was a nice little haul from that village. I got some good stuff so I can get better villagers than what I already have. It's going to be nice. And also breed more villagers now because of the beds, which that's even better. Do I need a ton of villagers? Absolutely not. Do I want a ton of villagers? Kinda.
All right. Um, but I think that should be good for now. I think mm. I'm going to go to bed. Get these Dagon villagers breathing more. Mm. And let's see what's up. Oh, I got a lot of rotten flesh now. That dude's probably going to be one of my more profitable ones at the moment. Just because of my mob farm that I have. getting emeralds from these villagers. Just some more emeralds. More everything, to be honest. Now, I actually wouldn't mind a wandering trader at some point in the near future. Not right now, but near future. But first... Uh, no, I don't need that right now, actually. What do I want to do right now? Trying to decide what I want to do. Actually, what I think I'm going to do is in the stream and call it a day because this was a good video session right now. Hour 20. That's a good, good, pretty good stream right there. I feel like. Um, thank you for joining me. Sorry that it's awkward. I'm still trying to get used to it, but I do appreciate you joining me in the stream today. I'm going to stream tomorrow after I get off work, so it'll probably be around 2-ish my time. So <laughs> it should be within around the same time I'm ending now. I believe it's 3 right now. Yep, so take it back an hour. I'll start the stream then tomorrow. And I appreciate you guys. Have a good day.